What's going on, you guys? This is Andrew Roboto here, and, and welcome back to Five Nights of Wario's Cabin Fever, where we will be continuing on Night 5 in Part 2 of this Let's Play. So, without further ado, we will take on, continue on from Night 5 in Part 2 of this video. Sorry, I messed up my words, and we will see what it has to offer for us. And I'm going to skip through the cutscene, because I don't need to see it. I've already read it. Okay. I'm hopefully going to beat it in part two. I don't know, though, but I hope I can, because this, this is just really hard. Especially because Diddy Kong starts to give me the issues at 3 a.m. Then Mario, I know, doesn't move till 2 a.m. So yeah. Okay, that's Wario and Waluigi. Not gonna check for them until they come in. Cause I can wait till I come in. Wait, I thought Peach knocked. Hold on, is that I heard a knock? I just went to check. Okay, here it is. This time, Peach knocked. Okay, one, two, one, two. Get okay, old Peach, so there you go. Now I gotta deal with Diddy Kong. And then who's up next? Kids. Up, oh, Wario. I mean, Waluigi, sorry. Okay, that was Waluigi. Here's Luigi. That was not Wario. That was Waluigi I just had to deal with. I thought it was Wario, but it was Waluigi. <laughs> okay, Mario's going to be coming up soon. He's going to be emer emerging from the floor. So i got to be ready for him. Wario. Okay, this time it's Wario. Okay, okay, so I couldn't deal with Wario right away because I got distracted by Mario. Ugh. Okay. God, Mario's evil laughter is so intimidating. Ugh. Okay. Jesus. And why does it bring you back, to, and one thing I don't understand about this game is why does it bring you back to the mode selection and not the standard mode menu? I don't, I don't get that. Okay, we'll try again. Okay. And I'm just going to pull up one of Peach's music sheets, because I know she's going to... She's going to be the first I deal with, with the, for the flute, then Waluigi, and then Wario. Okay, first got to deal with Diddy Kong, like always. I'm trying to keep his anger meter low. Okay. That's Wario and Waluigi. They pretty much have similar sound effects. Okay. I'm waiting for the knock for Peach to knock, then I can go deal with her. Right now I'm just gonna deal with Diddy Kong for now. Okay, I thought I heard Peach. Oop, oh, Waluigi. Okay, that was Peach. This time that was Peach. I had to deal with Waluigi first, then Peach. Now I have to deal with Peach. One, two, one, two. And I'm going to pull up Wario's sheet music so that I'm prepared for him, because he's going to be up next. Now to deal with Diddy Kong. And then Mario. Mario, I gotta deal with two. The second Wario comes in, Mario comes in too. Okay, Luigi. Bye bye.
Up. Mario, he's here. Okay, there's Mario. I heard his banging, so that's not good. War okay, this time Wario's here, so we can deal with him. One, two, four, one. Is that your Peach? Nope. Is that your Luigi? Okay, I heard Peach that time, but I'm going to deal with Diddy Kong real quickly. One, two, one, two. Okay. Mario, got it. Ah! Uh, Waluigi. Okay, I gotta deal with Diddy Kong quickly before he decides to... Luigi? Okay, I'm gonna deal with Luigi, then Diddy Kong. Because Diddy Kong's gonna rage any minute, and I gotta go check for Mario, too. So let's lower Diddy Kong's anger meter for a minute. Okay. Okay, that floor, the floorboard's draining pretty quickly. So I gotta deal with Diddy Kong and Mario and back and back to back. Okay. Did I hear Luigi? Okay, no I didn't. Okay, I gotta nail the floorboard down. Okay, let me deal with Diddy Kong, and then I gotta check for Mario. Because Mario's gonna break through the floors any minute. And we beat Night 5 on the, after only dying once in Part 2. So that's actually a good thing. Alright, Night 5 was pretty hard, but we beat it, nonetheless. Okay, oh, we got a cutscene. It's all coming together. This girl's med melody is enough. Enough to make us all stronger. Enough to strike fear. Oh, I think that's a church. Is that a church or something? Or what is that? It only just begun. Prepare! Oh. Okay, I don't know why my game just, just glitched out. I don't know why. Okay, so apparently, I don't know what happened, but, um... The game, my game just crashed. <laughs> right when I was reading the cutscene. Okay, so for some weird reason the game crashed, but we unlocked other modes. We unlocked a section, which is other modes. And we've also unlocked the extras. Which we're going to check out the extras. Okay, characters, let's take a look at that. We got Wario. Ca okay. Cabin Wario. Cause of death, beaten, eyes. Gogged. Eyes gogged. Cause of death, beaten, eyes gogged. Killing method devours victims' flesh. Ooh, that's pretty bone chilling. That's scary. Okay, Wario. The corpse of pre the previous fast food entrepreneur. Wario, his reanimated corpse. Okay, I, I just messed up. The corpse of previous fast food and entrepreneur Wario, his reanimated corpse, has more cannibalistic tendencies than the others. Typically the only one who eats his victims. He is being controlled on a mission to appease the one taking over his mind. He appears as Wario normally looks like. However, his eyes are gawked out, with one still hanging from a skull and rot. Okay, that's a pretty scary description. Okay, Cabin Waluigi. Cause of death, midsection torn out. Killing method beats victim to... Beat vic beats victim to death. Okay. The corpse of Waluigi, Wario's business partner. He is more brutal than the others when taking down victims. Using a previous victim's skull as a bludgeon weapon, 
he'll appease his master, but cares more about hurting the living. He appears like normal Waluigi, however his midsection flesh is torn out showing a spine. All right, next character, Cabin Luigi. Cause of death, heavy facial damage. Killing method hangs victims with the noose, which is the rope he's holding right there. Okay, here's the description for Luigi. The corpse of Luigi, face mauled by an insane assailant. Even though he's dead, he is still in constant agony due to the damage done to him. He'll do anything he's being told to, anything to stop the pain. He is very different in appearance to normal Luigi. His nose is ripped off, showing his nostrils and face flesh. The flesh of his mouth has been torn as well, showing, a realist, showing realistic teeth. He carries a noose to hang his victims. Okay, who's next? Okay, Daisy. Cause of death... Beheaded killing method is unknown. Okay, the corpse of Daisy, beheaded and left to rot. Bo her body is now in control of an unseen watcher. Unlike the others, she doesn't retain any emotion. The only resemblance to original Daisy is her bloodied body. Okay, who's next? Diddy Kong. Okay. No cause of death. He's possessed, as he is, he is currently possessed. His killing method is biting off the victim's head and spitting it out later. The body of Diddy Kong, unlucky enough to come across Warrior and become possessed by an unseen entity. He is now on a mission to appease his master. He looks similar to normal Diddy Kong. However, his eyes glow bright white and his jaw is heavily elongated. He seems to have hidden extra sets of teeth. He seems to have hidden s extra sets of teeth. He also seems to act differently when exposed to certain light, being calmer in bright areas. Next character, Cabin Peach. Cause of death, gutted. Killing method, strangulation. Alright, so, judging by these characters, um, Mar Mario is the only character I was not killed by. Okay. The corpse of Princess Peach stabbed and gutted by an assailant. The entity who took her over seemingly gave her more str strategic tendencies than the others. She looks similar to normal Peach. However, her eyes and mouth are now black holes. Her midsection is sliced open, exposing her organs. Okay, next character. Cabin Mario. Oh my god! Oh my god, Mario's missing a portion of his face! And only a skeleton is showing. And he only has one arm. Jesus. Okay. Okay, so this is what Mario looks like when he fully comes through the, the floorboards. I didn't know that because I never got killed by him. Okay. So the description... Okay, so here's the description for Cabin Mario. Cause of death... Six degree burns. Killing method drags victims to an uh, to unseen areas and then tears off their face. Okay, here's the description. The corpse of Mario, face being melted in hot steam. The one who did this to him has since been dealt with. He is very angry and isn't afraid to attack his victim in a disruptive manner. He is very different in appearance to normal Mario. His face being almost completely melted off, showing a skull with one eye remaining. His left arm has also been stripped of flesh. Okay, so that's all seven characters. Okay. Let's take a look at deaths. Oh, we got the jump scares. Okay, let's, let's see what the jump scares look like. I'm actually going to play the jump scares. I've seen them before except for Mario, but I want to play them again just because they're cool. Okay, that's all the jump scares. Okay. 
cut content. Okay, here's a description of the cut content. The game went through many forms in development. It started as a short game known as Five Nights at Warriors Fear. It only had nights one to five, and a custom night after talking with the team, it changed to a game known as Five Nights at Warriors Death Med Medley, where it was the same nights one to five and custom night deal, but it forced on using a radio for your survival. This same radio was used in the cabin's cutscene. Like the opening cutscene. Okay, so this is the... Okay, so these are the, the menus. So this is the main menu for Finance of Warriors Death Medley and Finance of Warriors Fear. Because that's what this game was originally going to be called. Eventually, the idea of being in a cabin was given and it went on from there. Thus, it got the name Finance of Warriors Cabin Fever. Next cut content. Ooh, we got the achievements. There was going to be an achievement menu in the trophy when room went unused. It was decided that trophies were more unique and that images of the trophies shouldn't have gone to waste. So the trophies were put back and the achievements were scrapped. I actually got to take a look at the trophies section because I know it's on the menu. Next one. There was going to be a mode known as factory mode. It would have had gameplay similar to Final Fantasy Warriors 2. Gino was a planned character for this mode. A prototype of this mode exists. Press enter to play the prototype. Interesting. Okay, so what's next? <laughs> God damn it. It shows a Goomba, a Koopa, and a Boo. And a King Boo. <laughs> Multiple different characters were planned for the game. Goombella from Paper Mario and King Boo have been thought of for the game. Even Koops, also from Paper Mario, had a design mode. In-game images for Goombella were made, but only single images exist for King Boo and Koops. Initially, the fire in the fireplace was planned to burn out and Goombella would drop down, and you would have to use a fire poker to get her away. <laughs> As seen in that picture. God damn it! <laughs> Okay, so what's next? There was a planned horde mode where it acted as a survival type game. You would have access to a knife, pistol, and a shotgun. You go through waves, fight enemies, upgrade weapons, and make it to a boss. It is unlikely this will be added back and back to the game. However, there might this might exist as something else in the future. Interesting. Okay. So the the cut con the sections of the cut content are actually pretty interesting. It would have been cool if these were in the game, because then we would get to play these. Okay, a grab bag mode was planned. It was a variation of a custom night, but it would always be randomized. This mode would also include random singular nights. This feature was kept in the game. Interesting. Okay, what's next? Okay, so Wario and Luigi looked much different in the initial stages of the game. An image of Mario without a ruined arm also exists, though scrapped when he was removed from a mode. Interesting. Okay, what's next? Alright, so that's about it for seven cut contents. Okay, so that's all the extras, and as you can see right here, we got a gold star for beating Knight 5. And now I'm going to go check out the trophy section. Because we have a trophy section we can check out. Oh, and we got a trophy for Wario. That's pretty cool. We got a Wario trophy. Have a rat. Wario trophy. Have a rat day. Unlocked by completing story mode, which we just did. Waluigi. Oh, yeah. Waluigi. <laughs> Unlocked by completing both bonus nights in the other modes section. The second note sheet and general picture flips to it. Press the letter that the murderer is named Star Wolf. Huh. Interesting. Okay, here's the Luigi trophy. I'm a Luigi, number one. Unlocked by completing all max custom mode. I'm sorry if, if, if these are bad character voices. I'm, I'm sorry if they're bad voices. Okay, Mario trophy. I'm a, I'm a the superstar. Not available yet. The Peach trophy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to do Peach's... Wait, is this Peach or Daisy? No, wait. The, oh, wait, this one's Daisy, that's Peach. Okay, let me take a look at the Peach trophy. I'm going to try to do her voice. Oh, get in. Okay, 
I'm sorry if that was a bad Peach voice. <laughs> okay, this one's Diddy Kong's. I'm trying to. F I'm, I'm gonna see if I can do Diddy Kong's voice too. I'm Diddy! Woohoo! I'm sorry if that was a bad Diddy Kong voice. Unlock by finding the secret. And then the Daisy Trophy. Not available yet. Let me try to see if I can do Daisy's voice. I'm gonna try to do it. That's right! Okay, I'm sorry if that was a bad. I'm sorry if all of my character voices are bad. <laughs> I can do like Wario, Waluigi, and Mario and Luigi's voice. It's a me, Mario! It's a me, a Luigi! It's a me, Wario! Have a rotten day! Wario is great! <laughs> Why, Luigi? <laughs> Okay, so that was the trophy section. Now I'm going to check out the other mode section. Okay, here's a description for that. Go here to play more modes such as Unique Singular Knights. Trophies, view trophies that you earn for progressing, progressing throughout the game. And then we have our flute skins right here. Let's go check out the other modes. Oh, pretty interesting. We have Custom Game, Investigation, CCTV Night. The end. So for custom game, we have select the AI for each character and then enter your own customized AI. Goof around with the AI levels or set them all to max and attempt the challenge. Investigation mode. This this night is made purely for fun and is not canon of the story. As an investigator, reveal evi reveals evidence photos while defending yourself from an entity slithering around the building. CCTV night. Bonus night. This night is made purely for fun. Another night cannon. Take the night shift out of school unluckily for you. Take This takes place before the cabin incident. The end. Okay. So. Alright, so we will take on... We will start the custom game challenge in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you've given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.